Yo, yo, how we doing? Shout out to Ron for telling me to build Griffin Wing on Heim. This is hands down a core item on him. And he's probably my favorite god to play right now. Because of this item, it's so much fun. Try out this build, and you'll probably have a good time. Um, one thing that I would say, though, you can try to go Leader's Cowl always, I would say. That's without question, into Devos. And then the second item, pretty debatable. You can go Axie if you have physical support, or you could go Kins. But third item should always be um, Griffin Wing. Man, this is so ridiculous, though. Medusa sucks to play up against, I would say, if you don't have pressure. Also, if you have a support, he's just chilling watching. And then he just dashes into a full wave. That's what I'm working with, boys. It is what it is, though. The best tip that I can give you for Heim, treat his ultimate as an execute, a dash to gap close on an enemy that just jumped, or an escape tool. Never use this ability to start off a fight if the opponent has beads or a CC immune ult. If you're even, you will always lose. Hands down, it is so hard to win fights by starting off with Heim ult when they immune it. Uh, this is just because his ultimate is clunky, it sucks, sometimes it can bug uh, to where you can't auto attack for a very long time after using the ult. And you just get two or three autos straight to your dome, or even your opponent's ultimate. Um, like in this matchup, if Medusa pre-ults and she expects me to ult, she can hit me in the dome with a uh, Medusa ult. So be wary of that. It'll improve your high gameplay. Also, what were those guys thinking? Two minute freaking four man gank. They double killed mid and just came over here and tried to ream us. My Cthulhu baited the Medusa. I, I can't, even, can't even blame him for that. It was a pretty trash play. All they had to do was back up, right? And then they get Cthulhu all for free. Is it just me, or does it feel like Bifrost? Um, like travel time, it just takes longer. I don't know why, man. Before, I used to be able to crystal a little bit ahead of me, walk up to the crystal, place another one, and then I would be able to TP super quick. But now, for some reason, it just feels so clunky. I did take a break with Heim, so maybe it's just Rust. But I've been playing them a lot lately, and it just doesn't feel as good as it did before. All right, I'm a total scrub for forgetting about this trick, but I played a ton of Heim recently, and I remembered it um, just through trial and error. All that you really got to do is make sure that the two crystals are close to each other, and then you'll get a quick leap once you place the other one out. So that's what it looks like when it's a quick TP. And for example, this is the slow TP, say that's your tower line over there, um, and you had a safe TP, but now you want to turn aggressive. Just look at how much slower that is. It's gross. So some good in-game scenarios to use this. If you're pur purely trying to chase somebody down, the quickest way to do it, say somebody's running this way, they already used their leap, and they're 1 HP. All you really got to do, hold the W key and spam your 3 three times 
and then you'll get the quick uh, leap. And you can combo that with your ult right off of the teleport. And, well, let's just see. This is where I traveled to. I'm not going to cancel again, just to, just to make sure that you guys know. And then you insta-ult. That's how far you go. All the way from over there to here. Another really good use to the Bifrost is auto attack canceling to keep the AOEs. So you auto, auto, and then three. Oop. Auto, auto, three. And that's how you do that. It can also set you up for a quick TP if you're fighting somebody. So you want to do this. And then you TP into alt. Just a couple more weapons to your arsenal. Um, but yeah, I completely forgot about this, and I'm glad I relearned it. Yeah, let's get back to the video. This game I did choose to go for Axe first. This is solely because I had enough gold for Axe and not Kins. Sometimes that happens, but I wanted to be as strong as I could on the map to be able to snowball this game. I am so fed right now, it's ridiculous. All I really need to do is auto one, uh, hit him with my one, auto hit him with the knockup of the two and alt and uh susano will die for sure um, poseidon would die right now medusa definitely die rdo would be hurting you just look at that that was two auto attacks and um just my one imagine if i had coons my little eye in the sky hmm that just sucked. I was trying to help out Cleo. For some reason, people love rotating to my lane when I'm not there. It just sucks. I could have secured that buff if I were just a better player. You don't want this smoke, Poseidon. <laughs> That shit's always funny, just watching them come back after basically watching a movie. And then just smacking them into the gray screen. Ripping wings online. Medusa, four levels down. You don't want to be contesting neutral camps when you are this far behind. Just bite the bullet. Try to keep your purples. Maybe call for assistance on your purples. And do back camps. Clear waves. It's okay to get crapped upon the first 20, even 25 minutes of the game. Um, once it gets to those Phoenix defenses, you should be able to do something if you didn't misplay horribly. Um, but that's just the problem with most people that play this game. Once they get down, it's like they want to have six. They don't want to try. Just want everything handed to them. Everything easy. You can see right now I got eight of my four, my team's 14 kills. Like I'm making an impact. I'm, I'm still trying out here. And it wouldn't have mattered if my team had zero kills and they had 30. I would still be putting in pressure effort and I would not quit so that's something that a lot of people can instantly improve upon is forget that there's a surrender button in the game and play your fucking games out Oh yeah, I might be putting out a couple streams. I know I haven't streamed in a couple weeks. What the hell was that doing? Oh my. Yeah, just be on the lookout for him. I might be streaming some COD. Call of Duty. When that comes out, I'm probably going to get sucked into it. I wonder what else, like, who else could do well with Griffin Wing? 
Charybdis just feels horrible to play. Uh, really don't like her kit right now, considering that her one is just rough, other than clearing waves. Yeah, somebody, something tells me this guy is uh, tilted. Six levels ahead of him, and he's just running it down. So don't worry, guys. I, I got the problem. I got the solution to this problem. So close to full build. I did choose to go for Leader's Cowl, and now I'm grouping up since I'm level 20. I'm going to have a huge advantage over everybody in the game right now. Like the enemy team... This power buff. Yeah. Even with me misplaying this horribly, I'm still still smoking. I know all the tricks of the trade. Yeah, this build works consistently, hands down, every single game. Um you could try going oboe instead of griffin wing if you really don't like this item but i'm telling you man this this item is just so good and you just look at this this could be you <laughs> turned into an absolute raid boss Towers don't stand a chance either. They get destroyed in like six hits. Or however much that was. That was a little bit more than six. Objectives get shredded. I mean, I'm a late game hyper carry. 24 minutes, 35 seconds. That's when I popped my 3k pot. And I have a 500 pot. Medusa's checked out. She said, oh, I, I forgot I was playing. These really are the games that, that you play Smite for, though. Just three hitting people with hit scan auto attacks. We should have taken so many more gold furies than we should have, and pyromancers and fire giants. Uh, it's just hard to coordinate with people. That's definitely the biggest struggle in this game for me. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Go out, try Heim. If you like Hunters, he's a ton of fun right now. And I'll see you guys around. Peace. You know I'm always honest. Never know I'll never stop it. I won't quit, keep going till I got it. Yeah. Mm -hmm.